You know what I'm saying? Good morning, beautiful queen, or whatever. I'll cook for you. <laughs> no, you know what I'm Make no, love to you. Make love to you. Not just fuck that you. That man is raw, baby. So that's yeah, what you got. Yeah, bro. Get him, brother. Yes. Real shit. Yes. Tell her stop capping. Tell her stop the cap. Real shit. Real shit. Here we go. You and I seen him with a meme up earlier. They said the man that you want ain't doing that shit. Be, be real granular when y'all say that, this. That's what you know. You see what I'm saying? You see? You see this? 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 This is fuckery. This is straight fuckery. So she this said, "We got to stop." She, she said, "If you ain't gonna do all that, she would rather reach in the drawer and grab her rose and deal with her rose before she deal with a man who ain't in tune with his emotions and all that shit." Well, she's she gonna be dealing with that motherfucker. She's gonna be dealing with that rose. That battery gonna fuck her clit up. We got you know to that battery gonna fuck her clean up. She's gonna be dealing with that motherfucker because Nick, once again, just like I said, it's brothers out there. That's man, she pretty as fuck. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, she pretty as fuck. You mean to tell me now, man, she need to stop it. And Kendra need to stop the foolishness with these hoes, man. <laughs> For real. Like, I'm dead serious, bro. This shit sad, man. Kendra is capping, yo. Man, this shit's sad. So I'm, one them, I'm, one, I'm one of them niggas that's willing to do all that shit, though. But once again, you over there. There you go. There you go, bro. There you go. I'm, yep. Man, bro, I just said, bro, man, shit. Like this, Fuck her, bro. I don't, I, don't even, I don't even feel bad for her, bro. <laughs> pretty girl. Hey, Banger, you were saying something about men get toys, too, huh? Oh, yeah, man. I mean, I, I hate to, to, to put it out there, you know, but I'm going to let it be known. <laughs> Fuck it. This is how they got this on. They, we don't, we're as men, there are toys way more effective that, that can be used. We, and now, if we start that fucking movement, it would be a lot of rich men. Because you could buy those cheeks, get drunk. You could buy those, those artificial cheeks, get drunk, <laughs> go home, destroy them artificial right, cheeks. Right, a whole, and a whole and your dollars came in right. your pocket. You could get them in <laughs> black. Hey, white, get white white hey, 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 cuz, tell them get that warm up jelly or whatever that shit they sell. I'm through. telling you, you know what they I'm just saying? Don't, they just don't know. Man, <laughs> you roll over, you hit that shit all you want every day, all day. That motherfucking body ball. It ain't me, but I know, I know, I know some people that I have worked with, men, and I'm like, bruh. Hey, did you say oh, he deployed? was like, no, nah, I ain't dealing with no female. Barry said, deploy them artificial cheeks. He went and got <laughs> some shit from China, bro. Ordered hey. that shit off Amazon. He showed me what that mug looked like. Dressed that hey. mug up and everything. He hey, got like three one, of them. Hey, one of one of me and Gavin's <laughs> first business endeavors was a, a company called the Pleasure Cafe. First it was <laughs> HH, then it evolved to the Pleasure Cafe to be continued. And we actually uh, sold uh, uh, was it, adult novelty items. So we were exposed to that via our wholesaler and stuff like that. And uh, yes, definitely a lot of toys out there. Well, yeah, stay tuned yeah. for that. Even from man, <laughs> can, can here we go. So, so here we go. As we, as we move forward, man, and here we go. Part of the men who, and women 
who are part of our, you know, Patreon and joining the members, you know, men, y'all might get this. Uh, we will be sending out pocket pussies and ladies, we're gonna be sending out toys to y'all. Stay tuned, stay tuned, boy. And, and a lot of this shit started in jail, man. Like, I worked in the prison system, man. You when when they get deprived of all that shit, you got dudes getting the, the old toilet paper roll, glove molds and maids. And I'm thinking like, man, I wonder if you he like, nah, man, I ain't about to go touch no man. I'm gonna make me a twat. <laughs> Listen, like, banger. Damn, Listen, like, banger. Listen, banger. Listen, banger. You made him a Gucci boy. I like, to, I like to coin myself a little Mad Max ish. You know what I mean? I'm a I'm a father for invention. You hear me? I'm a father for invention. But <laughs> and I tell you, you what, you, 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 listen, listen. I want to make myself clear. We can't duplicate sweet watery guts. Now we can't duplicate. Yeah, no. Yeah. Can't duplicate no, 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 no. You can't duplicate it. But if you ain't had no access <laughs> and your hands ain't soft because you've been fucking doing pull ups all day with callus <laughs> all over the mud, lover, you gonna find some shit to make the the. the to, to to get you to where you got to go, you ain't about to be sitting there ripping your own tool off, bro. With the monkey paws and shit, like you've been working on cars all okay. day. Okay, <laughs> we're gonna get back into it, man. Hey, man. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man, let's run on what he's saying right now. <laughs> you know damn well that lotion oh, ain't enough. Motherfucker we'll walking around with Vaseline, stuck his hand in gloves, and believe it ain't gonna get soft. Hey. Just so you can touch yourself. Man. Hey, when you hey, when you finally get a woman, she was like, you got calluses, but your hands are soft. Look, man, you, yo, hey, you'll be gripping the hell out of some ass cheeks, man. <laughs> the most yeah, balls and shit. Yeah, it ain't going nowhere. This yeah, that ass ain't going nowhere. It's grip, baby. <laughs> I see some hands where it looked like they just walked around and drugged, mm -hmm. and drugged their hands all over the ground all day, man. Not. Um, they can have kids. I love kids. I just don't have kids because I don't want to um bring kids into the struggle. I'm big on waiting until I'm married, waiting until I'm financially stable because you can't always depend on the man. Anything can happen. Life happens. He can pass away. All kind of things like that. So I just don't have kids because of that. Um, but if he does have kids, he has to be very active. I'm not talking about financially. I'm talking about active, like in his kid's life. I lost my dad at a young age, so that's very personal to me. So, um, yeah, he definitely has to be active in his kid's life if he do have kids. Um, but, yeah, that's pretty much it. He just needs to be emotional it's okay for men to be emotional, emotional. No. okay think... listen there's a lot of conversation about your instagram page what's okay hold on kendra let me show you since they're talking about my instagram page. yeah hold so on, what is on your instagram it. page because they're talking about your instagram page i guess they went to it oh, while you're on so if i'm an esthetician guy so if y'all don't know what that is i do facials waxing oh that's vagina yeah oh so so the i do, give you so, the permission to show their vaginas on yes. your face? Uh, my, my client signed consent forms, but um, yeah, I'm a businesswoman, so I'm promoting my business. I'm not selling coochie. I mean, it's just showing you before and after of a wax, and a lot of you should get a wax. <laughs> a lot of you might need to see her, right? <laughs> All right, so Kia, does the guy have to look a certain way? You know what, Kendra? No, he doesn't. And, and it's weird, and people will probably be like, oh, she lying, I did this, but I don't, my last boyfriend was probably about 400 pounds. Um, I've dated men about my height. I'm 5'5", five, five, so I'm not really picky. I just want somebody, you know, that's gonna love me. Be How much bread that. was in his pocket? Don't, yeah, she, right. she walk, see, I'm saying she walk around like she the fucking Goodwill or something. No, you ain't. No, no, no she, she seemed to have a head on her shoulders. Here we go. Like I said, one woman came on here and said she's too good to be a baby mother. And she just said she not about to bring her child into the struggle. These are her words. She said, I'm not for that struggle. It's a struggle. Being a modern day baby mama is a struggle. It's mm -hmm. not nothing to hang your hat on. It's yeah, nothing. 
proud of. It should be a very, very hard lesson learned. That's it. It is not something to hang a proud baby mom. Y'all sound like the Joker. Y'all sound insane when y'all say these things. Stop trying to justify your anecdotal ass experience. Because ask yourself, the route that you took, would you push this on to your child? To your damn near fatherless child? Would you push this on to them and say, hey, do what mama did? Shit, they doing it now, bro. It's crazy. You see, what, what you just said, man, they doing that shit now, bro. They doing it. They they telling it. You're right. You're right. I'm I'm you're right. You're right, Rob. They are. I'm tripping. I'm smoking with cigarettes. <laughs> <Shit>. <laughs> yeah. But nonetheless, you gotta hit that struggle. Read between the lines. It is what it is. She seemed like she got a little bit of sense. 29, no kids. She already doing her thing, doing her waxing thing. And she saying, like she said, I ain't got no, you know, saying no real preference. This is. No, this, this, she's full of shit. She's full of. No, oh, no. Oh, yeah. She, she, she is. That's, that's, yeah. that's wolfy. She's clothing shit. For sure. uh, I don't need a man. I, I just want a man that's going to love on me. And Because I didn't date a man. Like she said, 400 pounds, this and that, this and that. This motherfucker quit saying love on. Love. What she mean by love on her is buy her red bottoms, take her on vacation, make sure she eat lobsters every night. That's what she mean by love on her. Oh, for so sure. She, that, that's all code. She, she'll give you some pussy when she feel like it. <laughs> she, she definitely all cap at the same time as far as doing a good job promote herself. Two thumbs up. She doing a good job. She yeah, really good job. Knowing damn, when she just said that, knowing damn well them big niggas going to be hitting her up left and right. And she going to be... This like and I said, that, bro. Yeah, that's this that's like a scale. Yeah, they can be bro. for the hundo, but that bread yeah. need to be four four hundred thousand. Call it what yeah. the TI is. Yeah, that shit crazy, man. And this like I said, man, she had a dude, a couple of them that was on her heels, that wanted to really fuck with her, man. She just turned them niggas down, and she up here on Kendra, desperate in the motherfucker, and Kendra ain't doing no better. You know what I'm saying, like. She ain't keeping it real with her, like, yo, you I know you got somebody in your corner, like, but you know, it's it's in a, that's entertainment for them, bro. Yeah, that's entertainment. Yeah. See, I'm thinking like, you know what I'm saying? Like, these women as like she got success through this shit, like she hooking them up, they getting married, all that, you know. Man, they a joke on it, they a joke on here, man. And Kendra a joke with them, yo. <laughs> and I know Kendra sit back sometimes, like, yo, why did why did she even come on here? You know what? It is what it is. Yeah, Kendra know why. She knows she came on to be a highlight. <laughs> right, you know, but... All right, let's see what else she's saying here. Let's let her get like, to it. Be, be a man, but don't be too much of a hard man, but be a man. Be a man. Yeah. All right, um, does he have to make a certain amount of money? Yes, he does. How much does he have to make? He has to be... A stable six figures um, because at the end of the day, I am growing a business. So when I need help, I need help. So we have to have six figures and, and able to help you with your career. Mm hmm. When I need it. Okay. Could he have other women? No. No. Okay. What's the age range? Ladies and gentlemen, like I just said in the previous segment, she said you could be 400 pounds, you could be this, that. Y'all got to read between her language. She was not saying, she said, I need a man that's going to love on me. She want to talk about hugs and kisses. She talking about bread. That's her love language is bread. So <laughs> you she said, when I need help, I need it. You know what I'm saying? You fucking up your money. You fucking up your business money. You fucking up your business money. You know what I'm saying? Going on women, them trips and all that shit. Women sit here and they love to say, oh, I'm a strong businesswoman. And guys find that intimidating. Coming from a cage fighting defensive end, that shit is intimidating because that's a man talking like that. And I don't want to be dealing with no man talking about, I got a business. I need somebody to support me. I say that to my wife. That's what I'm saying. It is intimidating because it don't make sense. Y'all don't talk like that. All right, he got to have this because when it's time, I need you to move the way I need you to move. Yeah. Sound like some man shit. Yeah, got to have them six figures of bed. You know what I'm saying? My, minus the, the monetary thing, but telling somebody what they got to be ready to do when you say do it, 
That's you what do. I'm getting at. Because obviously, no man is coming asking for no bread. But just he got to be ready to do what I say when I when I'm ready. That yep. is not your place. So, so when she got a ten thousand dollar uh, what is that from an inspection or something? A ten thousand dollar fine or whatever and all that. Hey, I need that ten thousand out your pocket. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, we got that shit, nigga. I gotta, you know get these, I gotta get these uh permits and uh right. gotta get this house up to cold. Yep. Yeah, oh, cough, I need that. Cough that every, she, every little fucking hair brain scheme she come up with, <laughs> she want my fucking finance. Yes. Just, so you know what? She just she just shot herself in the face with a 12 gauge as far as I see it, because I was kind of rude for her. But that last little bit was a lot. Yeah, it's just the math, just the math. I know she want a tall man now, so she want her tall, dark and handsome. That's what they all say, and she want him making hundred thousand. Understand? Take, well, take that hundred thousand. I don't really care what you look like, so I I give her that. I would think she real ginger. There are women like her, like a fucking Tamar Braxton kind of woman. They don't give a fuck. Okay, you got that bag. You got that bag. Okay. So once again. <laughs> She she's smart. She's smart. No, she's let me be smart. Let me be, let me be, let me be, <laughs> but she's smart. Let me be making six figures right now, man. I'll probably I have like two wives right here right now. You know what I'm saying? There you go. Hey, you you funny on Facebook, but you even funnier because you got that pack, boy. You know what I'm saying? For sure. Like, come on, man. I ain't for sure. Ain't Big Ben's got that 550 Benz. What you talking uh, about? This is like I had a chick laughing at me because I posted my little food today on my little story. Bitch, you laughing because you want a sandwich. And when I was right. <laughs> and I was right. And I was right, man. <laughs> Can I come on again now? Nah, bitch, you want to use me for my food. Yes, you don't want sir. me for me. You know what I'm saying? Get out of here. It's that, yes, hey, sir. it's that time of year. Don't have them come begging. They going to start begging. Yeah, hey, hey, shit, I can't wait to spring it. Oh, 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 I got something for the ass with spring hit. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Shit. Man, fuck no. <laughs> Keep up the good work. Keep up the good work, my brother. Real talk. <laughs> oh, Lord. I don't think age is, a th age is not, it's like mentally. Like, how are they mentally? But age, I would say between, let's say 27, 40. 27 to 40? Yes. Yeah. No, let's say 30 to 40. 30, 30 to 40. Mm -hmm. 30 to 40. Oh, you don't want to date anybody your age. It's, it's a struggle there. It's a struggle mm -hmm. like my age. Hey, I've been struggling with the 40 years old. That's why I said age is not the thing. It's where you are mentally. It's all here. Okay, fair enough. All right, Kia, let's do the Kendrick camp. Okay, hold on. Let me... I need you to come in. Let me go in the restroom. I ain't got no bra either. So what, y'all? Oh, oh. Oh, I'm sorry. Hold on. Okay. You look good. All right. So, Kia, does the guy got to be in Houston? It's a common woman. One thing, here we go. Here we go. Women, and we 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 hit on this all the time. Everybody on this panel loves sweet pussy. Women are beautiful creatures. Ain't no man up here hate motherfucking women, I promise you. It's the software that we are criticizing. Always understand that. So y'all come up, like these are common women a lot of times. All women come equipped with a set of boobs, a set of cheeks, some moist between their legs. Y'all all come equipped with this shit. Quit acting like you some special fucking LTZ model. You know what I mean? You, you the highest level of this shit. You're like, yeah, them is women, but I come with heated steering wheels and shit. You know what I mean? Yeah. No. All y'all ain't AMG series. All y'all ain't M series. Seriously. Y'all not. Y'all not. Some of y'all the basic package. Package. LS. You know? <laughs> Seriously. Stop. Most of y'all. hand crank windows. You hand crank the windows and shit. What is that? Oh, what, is? what is that DYI channel and shit? Whatever they stack like houses, the new houses, man. Yeah, that's uh, they gotta it's, have they gotta have that, you know, that the newest shit that comes with it. You know what I'm saying? You ain't got all that. You get the fuck on. No, we don't gotta Seriously. be Houston, baby. Come take me away. 
Come take you away. You ready to reach? I thought you growing your business there, though. Uh, I am. So how would you move? I mean, we can pack up, move the business, baby. Let's let's go. He's open to it. All right. So, when was your last relationship? My last relationship was a year ago. Okay. You don't have to answer, but I'm gonna ask. When's the last time you was intimate with someone? With someone, or with my draw. You can answer both. Oh, with my draw last night with someone. How about a month ago? Is that she lying. She, lying. she got to think too hard, bro. Y'all coming on here. Here we go. And this is a common theme. These women be coming on here and they all be having sex with different men within the last 30 days. You cannot. She's not, even, not even a day, a, 20, a 24 hour period, bro. Here you go. I was being liberal. Let, but, hey, hey, let a woman, no. hey, bro, let a woman ask us right now when the last time we fucked. We could be like, oh shit, we just had sex yesterday, or we just had five sex five minutes ago. Oh, you nasty whore. You you da, 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 da. you know what I'm saying? But they can just have sex just now. You know what I'm saying? Ten minutes well, she, ago. She said she on that rose last <laughs> night. She popped that drawer open every night. And that's yeah. the problem. Yeah. You know, you know, like you said, you're gonna put that rose to your motherfucking clit numb, and then a man gonna come in here and you're gonna say he can't make you come because that rose done wore your ass. Out. Fuck you up. Got your shit wrong. Yeah. Yup. Yeah, I read it. Y'all, y'all single. Now your click, now your click this thing. Now your click this sitting there with no senses. I'm just flicking that motherfucker for no reason. You yeah. know what I'm saying? No reason though. No, there's no reason. You know what I'm saying? So y'all out here with, with nerve damage to your clitorises? That's bad. Y'all got nerve damage to your little man in the boat? That's y'all out here. Nerve. Need, and then they got the nerve to talk about somebody like, oh, he, he, he ain't big enough, or oh, he can't feel it, I can't feel it, nah, bitch. <laughs> Yo, numbness, need, you, you didn't want the numbness, you done took everything to fill it all, that bitch. You know what I'm saying? Like, fuck out of here. Straight votes at megahertz to get tape. <laughs> get they shit going, baby. Doracell done fucked you up, bitch. <laughs> you about to have little batteries. <laughs> <laughs> and, <laughs> and that's why she's a mercenary. She ain't looking for a man. She don't give a fuck. She just want your bread. No, yeah, 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 the, yeah. The bread though, but can't nobody compete against that rose, bro. She don't want you to. She's you gonna, you gonna be up there humping. You gonna be up there humping just to be humping, bro. You yeah, just that, gonna be like you said. She might be stingy. With just for no time. reason. <laughs> you the kind of woman be like, oh, I don't feel like it tonight. I'm working on my business. You see what I'm saying? Y'all don't get it. Uh huh. <laughs> right. That shit crazy. She she ain't in the mood that the bread on her mind. Mm-hmm. Like a man. She acted man. I was gonna say again, that sound like a man. Yeah. That's that's a rule, uh beans. Yo, your woman's supposed to be into you more than you into her. Yeah, that, that's good. That's it balance. She's supposed to be into you. She's supposed to be impressed by the way you move. And that's then that's what the just the way it's supposed to be. If it's the other way around. Is 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 hurting you and her? Trust me, trust me. Yeah, that's facts, man. Yes, like Gav said, for her to be out there talking about, oh, you know, I got a business, I ain't in the mood. That's some a dude be saying out there on his purpose, getting getting his shit right, and she come over here nagging her, nagging her with the lingerie. That's that's how that's supposed to go. It's reasons for that. It's creates a balance. Yeah. If you got a big yo, if you got a if. You, if you got a request, ask for, suggest sex, you go in the wrong direction. And wrong direction. All right.